two brand new SMGs have been added into Ring of Elysium, the P90 and the Scorpion Evo 3. In today's video, we're going to focus on the latter, the Scorpion Evo 3. Without further waiting, let's get into an in-depth guide to the Scorpion Evo 3. And the Scorpion Evo 3 fires 9mm ammo and has full auto, single and burst fire modes. It holds 40 rounds with an extended magazine and 30 without. And the Scorpion can take any barrel attachment, any grip, and all sights except the 8x. Being an SMG, the recoil of the Scorpion is very low already, but this can be further reduced with the use of attachments. Shown on screen is a graph produced to show how much the attachments are affecting the recoil. Interestingly, the SMG compensator actually reduces vertical recoil more than the grip, unlike the AR compensator which reduces it less than the vertical grip. Otherwise, the order remains the same for how much the attachments affect the recoil. And let me know if you guys are interested in a video explaining how the attachments affect the statistics on the weapons. Obviously, an SMG is going to have significantly less recoil than that of a rifle, and that can be seen here where it has been compared to the FAMAS. But we're interested in getting the best recoil on the weapon in question, which of course is the Scorpion. Shown on screen is the Scorpion with no attachments against one with a compensator and angled grip and one with a compensator and vertical grip. As you can see, the angled grip has more vertical recoil but significantly less horizontal, and in my personal opinion, this makes for the best setup, having a compensator and an angled grip. This allows you to reduce the random nature of the horizontal recoil and allows you to solely focus on the vertical recoil. The damage of the Scorpion isn't going to be breaking any records, with it being the second lowest in the game, only having more damage than the Glock. Shown on screen is the damage on different parts of the body and different armor levels, the bullets to kill, rounds per minute and damage per second. I did include level 3 armor as this is currently in the game, however there is rumor that this may be removed at a later date. Despite the low damage, having the highest fire rate in the game allows the Scorpion to put up a pretty decent number for damage per second beating most rifles apart from the FAMAS, AUG, and Groza. The bullet speed of the Scorpion is very low compared to that of most rifles. This means that the bullet travel time is going to be very high. This causes the bullet drop-off of the Scorpion to be very high as well. I decided not to include this in the video as I didn't want to encourage the use of this weapon at such ranges. In my personal opinion, this weapon isn't going to replace the FAMAS or Groza as a secondary, as these weapons remain much more potent. However, it certainly is proving itself to be the strongest SMG and has changed the early game significantly. It is good to see the developers diversifying the meta of the game by adding in these new weapons and I'm sure it's greatly welcomed by the community. I also stream on Twitch every Monday, Thursday, Friday, Sunday at 2pm GMT and Tuesdays at 5pm GMT if you want to stop by and ask some questions and catch some real time content. Thank you very much for watching and let me know what weapon you would like to see next.